I heard about a couple of women who always started their mornings with taking a winter bath. And since I live by Kalsjön, which means the cold lake, I was thinking, well, maybe I should try. And so every morning I go down to the lake and I take a bath. You can feel your body going into the water and then how your heart starts to beat. You need to be present, breathe, focus on just being here and right now. It's freezing cold, um, but also in a strange way, very relaxing. I love to be outside when it's cold, but I do not want to freeze. I got this jacket when I was moving to Kebnekaise, the highest mountain in Sweden. And the first day I got there, it was really, really cold and it didn't get warmer. So I understood that I need to buy this jacket. Being outside in the wintertime is a very strong part of uh, my DNA. I love to be able to just go outside the door, no matter the temperature and just enjoy nature. It's essential. Um, I think in nature I find both uh, adrenaline and peace. That means a lot to me to be able to go out and enjoy both the forests and the mountains and to be able to do so. I need to have the right gear and the right clothes. I grew up in the mountains and my family spent uh, the winters skiing with their dogs, sleeping in tents. And we got to learn the, the importance of being able to keep warm. I had a Fjellraven down jacket as a child. Uh, it's like a warm, hugging friend that you can bring on your adventures. I would say this jacket is iconic for Fjellraven because you see it everywhere when the temperature is low. You can see people wearing Fjellraven expedition. I got the jacket secondhand from an older lady who had already experienced lots of adventures in it. It has kept me warm for the last five years, and I look forward to spend more time in it the years to come. My name is Lisa Lindblom. I am a educated wilderness guide. I live in Kalbygden, which means the cold village in Swedish, and I'm proud to be a former world champion in sled dog sports. <laughs>